interrupt you, but uh, are you sure you're playing that piano correctly? It doesn't seem like your key pressing matches the music. But, Daniel, don't judge my piano playing style. It's just how I roll. And it's still great playing music, you know? Wait, wait a minute. When did your voice change? What are you talking about? I always had this voice. I'm just trying to make it more prominent. Oh, or is it plot convenience, I wonder? And yes, I am breaking the fourth wall today. You know, like, um, that Deadpool, Steve from Blue's Clues, Kermit the Frog, and Ola Holmes. Yeah, I've been watching some Netflix movies while I was gone. Gone from what exactly? Well, allow me to tell you, and also show you the story. About three years ago, I decided to relaunch my YouTube channel. It was pretty fun, I did skits, reviews, and even short films. I even met a few interdimensional friends along the way, as well as an arch nemesis who is a real mystery maker to my videos. And yes, I am aware with what I just said. I have to pull this out. Although a while back, I kinda had a lot of busy stuff to do, so I decided to stop making videos for a very long time. But now, since I'm back, I cannot really think of a good idea for a comeback video, leading to the situation becoming like this. Idea one... You know, Daniel, maybe you should take a break from all this idea storming or whatever. Maybe watch some TV or something. You know what? That's a great idea, Lina. I think I should do that right now. So, what's up with the badge? It appears to be from the Dimensionary Force? The Dimensionary Force? Oh yeah, I know them. They're like a, a special group that uh, uh, specializes in mission maker activity from across the universe, or should I say multiverse, like, you know, your universe and my universe. Wait, wait, wait. You're saying there's a special force that um, specializes in mischief maker activity and you never told me about this until just now? Why? Yeah, I kinda had a bit of a rough history with the commander of that force. She's uh, she's my ex. Of course it's something stupid. Look man, she didn't want to see me after our last encounter we had, so um, that's why I didn't tell you. Who cares? You risk our lives thanks to following her wishes. <sighs> okay, I need to calm down. Uh, we, we still managed to manage the situation with our mischief maker problem, right? So, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It's, yeah. Anyways, you want me to read the rest of the letter? 
Yeah, sure. I'm kind of curious what they have to say about us. Okay, let's go. Dear Daniel, we would like to apologize for not getting to your mission maker problem sooner. All our agents are busy with other missions, and your war barely had any mission activity beforehand. But we're surprised that you held your own against your apparent arch nemesis, which is why we'd like to give you this badge as a token of gratitude. If there's anything you need from us, just use the mail address that's inside the box. P.S. If you encounter white gloves and a British voice again, please let us know. He's a super powered being named Challenging Charles, who is very powerful and can cause serious damage to worlds. Oh, yeah, I remember that guy. He's the one who, like, merge our worlds together and also turn them to toy bricks for some reason on occasion. Yeah, and somehow we had an entire series on our channel. I do hope we don't see him again. He's a real pain to deal with. Oh my god, Lee, Lee Nan. Uh, he's here! The challenging Charles is here! What? Where? Where? Daniel, I don't see! Him. Oh god, he's gone! Eh, he'll be fine. I mean, he snapped his fingers and disintegrated into thin air before it was cool, so... and still came back from it, so, uh... Yeah, I think he'll be fine. I don't need to worry. You know what? I think I'll just keep the piano and do something else instead. Yeah, I'll do it right now. You know, I had my doubts about the Mr. Maker meeting today, but I think that went pretty well, Mr. Troublemaker. I agree, Interrupter. And by the way, what do you think of the brand new office that I provided you? Eh, nah, it's alright, I guess. I mean, it's not as spacious as the previous office I had, but uh, I was able to manage. Well, that's good to hear. So, um, I think that's all for now. Um, I have a bunch more Mr. Maker deeds to attend to, so, um, See ya. Well, okay then. See ya. Alright, since all my deeds are done, I think it's finally time for me to watch some cat videos again. What in the world? Oh. <sighs> oh. Oh. Man. Where am I? Daniel, what are you doing in my new office? Oh yeah, your new office. Man, things are really changing today. Lina's voice now this. Wait until you see my boss's voice. <laughs> oh, this is just great. First, I cannot think of a good idea for the comeback video, now this. Well, well, wait, wait a minute. You're saying that the Super Daniel Rocket can't think of an idea? Um... Yeah? No, no. That, that's not the Daniel I like to interrupt. You know what? If you tell me the truth on why you cannot do your whole comeback video thing, then I'll spare you my mischief making. Fine, if you really want to know, here it goes. The real reason is that uh, I'm just worried what people would think of the comeback video. I'm just scared that it won't meet the viewers expectations and all that. Are you serious? You know, before I met you, it was difficult for me to find an arch nemesis. With all the superheroes, wizards, or witches, and of course secret agents, not really feeling that interesting to me. But I did in a certain teenage content career. And I didn't care what my fellow mischief makers thought of my so-called art choice form of art genesis. It didn't stop me from what I wanted to do. Because I believe that it was the right choice. And you should too. And besides, the feedback can come later. You know, you're right. <sighs> Thanks, Interrupter. I needed this. And this feels very weird. Yeah, I know, right? It's a bit weird getting advice from your arch nemesis over here. 
No, I meant like there's a very weird feeling in my body. Um, okay then. I guess he's gone now. Oh well, time to watch some cat videos. Wait a minute, who... You. Were you the one who teleported me just now? Why yes, I am the one. Thank you. I don't care what your thought process of you doing this, especially with a mind like you, but uh, you really did bring my spirits back up again. And I think that's all that matters right now. And I just felt like doing it. Oh yeah, by the way, is this your true form? Huh, absolutely not. My true form is vastly different and too hard for you to comprehend. I had a top hat. Anyways, see you next turning you into toy bricks time. Not really looking forward to that. But I am looking forward to what I'm about to do. Hey guys and gals, it's me Subiday Rocket, and I'm finally back. Ready for lift that super dang rocket. Ready for lift that super dang rocket. He's ready to go. Review movies and shows and other stuff too. And sometimes the lack of food and our fantasy. The green is gets crazy, the things is a skip. As well as the short films because he's super dang rocket. Get ready for it. Ah, interrupter, cut it out, you nut. You're gonna mess me up. If I can't have the universe my way, then you won't have it at all.